Today I'm going to give you an introduction to Google Calendars. Like most calendars, you can change the view. You know, you can take a look at the individual day, um, the week, the month, etc. And over here where it says five days, you can customize that to have it show any duration you want. Three days, seven days, it's up to you. Click on an event to get its uh, generalities and click on edit to get to the description. Let's go back to the calendar. You can also move those events around anywhere you want just by clicking and dragging. To create an event, click the create button in the far left side. Give your event a title. Oh, you know what? I already got a meeting with Carrie, so let's change that. You can pick the, the day, the time. Um, you can even make it so it's a Google Hangout, share it with people. It's very, 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 very handy. And then you just you can pick whatever calendar you want to go to. And then when you're done, just click Save. To do a quick ad, which is another nice feature. Oh, there's my meeting with Andy. And to I'm going to right click on this. I'm just going to delete it. There you go. Um, to add something very quickly, just click on the little arrow, the little triangle there. And then you can just type in, here you go, dinner tomorrow with Jennifer at 7 p.m. And if you scroll down, there it is. Right click and delete that as well. <clears throat> Over here on the left side, you can hide your different calendars. So it'll let you really focus on what you really want to, what you want to see. You can also create a calendar, cl clicking on that little triangle, create new calendar will take you to this page. Just type in the information that you wanted to say, the calendar name, for example. There you go, call it meetings. And then when you're done, you click create calendar. Another thing that you can do, which is very, very, very handy, is that you can share your calendars. So if I go over there on the meetings and I click the little triangle, I can change the color of it so how it shows up. But also, I want to share this calendar. So when you share a calendar, you get two choices. You can make it visible for everybody at DAA to see. That doesn't mean it shows up for them. They have to go and search it. And when they search it, they can find it and access it. And or you can make it public to where anybody can see. Really simple, very handy. When you're done with that, click Save. And that pretty much brings us up to the end there. So I hope you learned a little bit about Google Calendars. I hope you found it helpful.